Hey guys, I'm back with two lines that I um, got today. These weren't given to me, so these are going to be my real actual reviews on them. Um, I wanted to review them because I like to know and I, I kind of watch videos um, and stuff about different um, flavors and stuff. And a lot of people out there like a lot of the creamy ones and stuff like that. Well, guess what? I'm a fruit girl. I like all my fruit. This is cleaning day, so I get to look as ratchet as I want. So let's get right to it. So I ended up getting the... I've already tried these. And I thought about doing the video where I was trying them. Um, but it was taking too long. And guess what? I have no clue how to freaking edit this shit yet. So... I just go one swoop through it, and if a bug comes by, like in the last one, then, oh well, then you see a bug. Um, I don't cut and edit, I don't have any sparkly things flying over, I don't have any music in the background, and you can tell um, I didn't dress my room up for this, so this is just strictly informational for me, um, and hopefully for you. So, what I got is the... Pachamama. I got all three of them today. So let me get the boxes because I already took them out and I smoked them, vaped them. So the ones um, that they have, and these are by Charlie's Chalk Dust, and we all love Charlie's. So this is the fruit line finally that came through, which I've been totally excited to get my hands on, and I was able today. So the ones I got were Mango Pattaya and pineapple then strawberry guava and jackfruit which one is that one blah, 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 blah. and then peach papaya and coconut cream that one was my favorite so you get to taste all the different flavors i really really liked this one you could taste the peach you could taste the papaya you could taste a little bit of coconut and barely any cream, but it made it a smooth vape, which um, I enjoy not having um, it like really creamy. I'm not a big, I'm a huge dessert person in general, but as far as vaping it, it's just not my cup of tea. So that one was super, super good. The peach, papaya, uh, coconut, and coconut cream. It's at a 70-30 blend and... I vaped it at uh, 3 milligrams. And next was the strawberry, guava, and jackfruit. I have no clue what jackfruit is. Um, they This one was, it was, it was good. It was mixed together. It's a good fruit one. Um, like I said, I don't know what jackfruit tastes like. So how the hell am I supposed to, <laughs> to know if I taste it or not? So there's something else in there with the strawberry and the guava. Um, so if you didn't know what you were vaping on, then it would be like, oh, there's something there. And you'd be pissed off. So, but it's really good. So I'm really, I'm really excited about these fruit flavors. So the next one was the mango pitaya. I hope I'm saying that right. If not, I am so sorry to where that native fruit's from. And pineapple. This one, um, I don't know what a pitaya is. Pitaya, 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 pitaya. I don't know what it tastes like either. Um, I tasted the mango with a little bit of pineapple. This kind of mixed all the in together for me. So, um, the layers weren't there, which we all like the layers. Um, okay. I'm lying. I don't know if you like the layers or not. I don't care. I like the layers. I like to be able to taste all those different flavors, um, at a time. This one, it was just kind of a mixture, so it's a good mixed fruit one, um, it's kind of like island fruit uh, type, because it has that pineapple in it. The pineapple was very, very slight in it, but they were all super good. I would um, rebuy them again. I have, I would tell you to go out, if you're a fruit person, to go out and get them, but by far, peach, papaya, and coconut cream. Love it. The other one, I'm... Um, doing today tonight right now is tribal vapor oh, i'll get this right i promise i like my skulls on there there's a skull up there 
So these are from 2016. I mean, these are like a brand new vapor company, I guess, out of um, Texas. I didn't even know that when I picked them up today. So I have their, pro, um, I'm looking their um, flavor profiles up right now so that uh, you can know what they are. They are mostly dessert except for one. Um, so there is Big Chief. Let me find them for you, which it doesn't matter because all the bottles look the same pretty much. So Big Chief, it says it's a commanding, a commanding blend of creme brulee. Fuji apple and drizzled caramel. I didn't taste that apple. I tasted creme brulee and I tasted caramel and I didn't care for it just because it's uh, it's not my flavors. I don't like the dessert flavors myself, but it is a good vape. I wish I had had some more of that apple though. I think um, some more of the apple would have really taken it over and been able um, to take it more into a fruity dessert than just a dessert. And unfortunately, I just put that in its little category, dessert. And so, the next one is Rain Dance. Okay, so, man, I'm this one I really, really, really wanted to like because it is, it says, Rain Dance, make your taste buds dance with a honeydew, cantaloupe, tangerine, cucumber, and mango rain. Which ones do you think I tasted? Mango. <laughs> All I tasted was mango and a little bit, but, but I usually don't care for honeydew and cantaloupe, but this one was slight and it wasn't like an in your face, in your throat, melon taste. Um, that's what I don't like. So all these definitely did smush together, but I did not find any cucumber in this whatsoever. I wanted to because I love cucumber mint. Um, a diff from a different uh, company. So I was really excited. I didn't really taste the tangerine either. Um, that's just me. But it's a really good vape though. It's a really good fruit one. So the next one is Last Stand. So this one was an interesting one for me. Uh, um, it says vanilla and butterscotch custard with a sneaky, I like sneaky, pecan, blackberry, and peach surprise. I tasted vanilla custard and then the blackberry and the peach. It was really, really, really good. Like I said, not a dessert person, but it mixed the two together and it kind of, it made it really good. I'm not a custard person. I'm not a dessert person, but the inhale on it is that, that nice vanilla custard and then the exhale is peach and blueberry it really just sneaks up on you like it says it does because you exhale and you're like oh, what was that so that was really good really good my last one this was a really good one too i'm really impressed with this brand um i really thought being that they were four desserts well three desserts and one fruit with melons that i would not like it but this one is white buffalo a rare beast, white macadamia nut cookies, and toasted marshmallows. This, the minute you hit it, you can taste the nuttiness, uh, the cookie. It was really, really, really good. The toasted marshmallows are there. They're just kind of uh, in the back. But by far, this is pretty damn good. So if you like desserts, you like cookies, this definitely tastes like a macadamia nut cookie. And I don't even like macadamia, but this vape's really good. So I'm really, really happy with the stuff that I got today. I hope you enjoyed my reviews on my stuff. Like I said, these are my reviews. It's nobody else's. They're not telling me what to do. They're not sending me shit for free so that I'll talk good about them. Um, these are ones that I acquired on my own. And if you have any questions, except when are, am I going to get my roots done? Cause that's tomorrow. Then, um, uh, ask questions. Um, if there's one do you want me to try, cause I have tons here. Um, I can't necessarily get through all of them. Um, but I'll definitely review them. 
and please follow me on Instagram as Texas Vapor Babe. All right. Thanks, guys. I really appreciate you watching, and I look forward to your feedback and your questions.